Sorry, with Caleb Kern of Edgerton, um, I know it's not the way you wanted to end, mm -hmm. but you had a, it was a long first putt mm -hmm. from a tough location. All in all, how do you feel? You, you, how do you feel that you handle the conditions and uh, does something like that make you hungry for tomorrow? Um, for sure. I hope tomorrow will go just as good. Um, really just not making big numbers was what I thought going in today with the weather would have been good and we kept ourselves to only bogeys so that's always good and then made a few birdies which really helped even them out and I'm excited to play tomorrow. Um, when you found out it was nine holes this change strategy do you feel you've got to do anything special with just nine versus 18? Not quite for me I think still the last nine holes will count so just keeping yourself in at the first 18 will be big. Um, and then as a team you know, you're, you're, I mean, this is, this thing's far from over. What, mm -hmm. what do you feel you have to clean up tomorrow? And uh, how do you have to kind of attack uh, smartly in order to, you know, close the gap on Lakeland? Uh, I think we have a lot of young players. So I think just getting over the nerves today was big and tomorrow it should settle in and hopefully a bit better weather to not have to focus on and we should be good going in tomorrow. Did you get food during the delay or are you like- <laughs> I did. Okay, good. <laughs> And, and what what did the delay do? I mean, did you get like one hole in before the delay? I had two shots in. Two shots in. I, I hit my tee shot in 10 and my second shot. But wow. Ended up making a good putt, and that was a good way to start, a, start, the, start the real round today. Absolutely. Well, Caleb, good luck tomorrow. Thank you.